Meet Bicycle! Hello everybody! Welcome back to another modded weapon guide here on Borderlands 2. Today we are back and we're going to be looking at a, uh, another modded weapon that's been put up on the uh, community github. Uh, and this time it's a, uh, a new variation of a, uh, a pistol and it's made by Dashiku um, and this one is called the Jurisdiction. Um, so as you can probably tell by the, uh, the weapon in hand right now, this is a replacement of the Maggie pistol and uh, I've absolutely loved uh, playing with this thing and uh, actually giving it a try out. It's a really fun pistol, especially with the right setup. Um, I probably haven't got the perfect setup going right here, but uh, you can see this thing is absolutely mental when you uh, actually get it going, get it firing. So uh, yeah, I really had a lot of fun playing with it and uh, I'm going to show you guys uh, exactly how to get it and uh, run through what it's all about and give it a try out and tell you what I think of it. So without further ado, let's get on with the guide and uh, I'll start off by showing you quickly how to get it. So uh, as always, it's um, linked in the description. Uh, click on that and it'll take you straight there. But if not, head over to the uh, Borderlands community GitHub, click on Borderlands 2 mods and into Dashiku and then you'll see the jurisdiction just there. They're all in alphabetical order, so it's pretty easy to find. And uh, this will take you to the main file that you need to know. Everything in there, uh, all the info and stuff is there. Click on raw and then save as and save directly into your Borderlands 2 binaries folder. Uh, and then uh, just remember to activate it in the console commands uh, before you uh, come into the game. So like I said, you're going to need a Maggie for this. Um, this is the uh, overview of it. Nice little p pink weapon. I don't think we've uh, seen a pink weapon um, yet, so uh, that's pretty cool. Like I said, it still does uh, look like a Maggie as well, as you can see. Um, so easily recognisable, really. Um, but that's exactly what it looks like. So we'll run through exactly what it's all about. You can see on the weapon card right there all the details and things like that. Um, so, like I said, this replaces the Maggie. Um, it does break the Sandhawk and the Thunderbolt Fist having this activated, so don't use them with this. Uh, and this gun is represent, uh, meant to represent Nisha, so uh, it's uh, meant to represent the, uh, the Lawbringer. That's why we're going to take it right here to um, Lynchwood to give it a try out. Nisha's stomping ground. Um, so I'm using zero with this character and uh, using uh, like a critical kind of setup with him. Absolutely brilliant for uh, pistols and things like that. Um, so shots plant explosive bombs inside of enemies, uh, and this is representing the Unforgiven. And not grenade gets Reaper skill. Shots also deal bonus explosive damage. The closer the enemy, the more damage it deals. Um, representing short fused and not grenade gets Reaper again. Um, it has nine shots in the mag which is uh, representing the Magnificent 6 and Fistful of Bullet skills, and it has a chance to shoot twice. 20% chance that is, and that's Hell is coming with me. Increased accuracy and recoil reduction represents Snapshot, um, and the, um, it also has a small chance to fire an extra shot as well. Consumes two ammo per shot, and of course with it being Jacobs, it will fire as fast as you can pull the trigger. So that's everything you need to know about the jurisdiction. Um, and yeah, as you can see, I'm giving this thing a try out right now. It is absolutely awesome. Uh, you do need to obviously get overpower rate, as always with all weapons nearly. Um, get some slag on the go for this to be absolutely really effective. It's uh, just so fast firing, it's unreal. Like I said, it's, um, I've geared this zero up and skilled him up to uh, to fire pretty quickly anyway. Um, but yeah, you can hit fire this uh, very accurately as well. It's um, very accurate. Uh, in hip fire, but if you aim down the sights, you can really get a good shot on them. Uh, I just absolutely love it. It really is so powerful. If you can get an enemy um, with plenty of slag on them and uh, get very close to them, you can just crit the hell out of them. So uh, yeah, really, really fun build. Really good pistol to use. I really recommend actually uh, trying this thing out. Actually, um, but yeah, just running through Lynchwood and um, slaying anything that's uh, put in front of us. These guys are not, you know, easy enemies normally. These are big, tough bone crushers and uh, they're going down pretty well actually and uh, it's actually been quite nice to use a pistol build um, on, a, on the assassin normally I do use sniping only on this character but uh, I thought I'd give it a go um, especially with a previous weapon guide that I did used uh, zero four it's opened up a new light to me really but uh, yeah anyway guys there you go that is um, the jurisdiction pistol made by Dashiku over on the community uh, github go ahead give it a try out and let me know what you guys think I absolutely love this thing 
and uh, we'll be using it uh, probably for future videos as well just because it's a bit of fun um so yeah anyway thank you guys for watching really hope you've enjoyed and i'll see you in the next one